Okay guys, we made it into California and it was not what we expected. We took uh, Route 66 from Arizona and w once we crossed the border into California, we basically were right in the middle of the Mojave Desert and the bus really, really struggled getting up the hills in the heat. I think it was like 98 degrees today and uh, I was worried that the engine was gonna blow a few times, but Old Faithful made it through and so we're really stoked to be here. Um, but we have not seen anything in California yet. It has just been mountains and desert everywhere. And what's cool is that I got on Harvest Host again and we were able to connect with Roy's Cafe and it is in the middle of this ghost town in the middle of nowhere that uh, I guess used to be a city back in the late 1800s. I think when Route 66 was being built, uh, this was a hot place to stop because it was the only place for miles and miles where you could uh, eat, sleep, and uh, fill up for gas. So when interstates became a thing, Route 66 became less popular and therefore this town of like 150 people back in the day kind of dissipated. There are still trains that come by, uh, so it's cool to see them drive through the, uh, the mountain landscape, but it's a living ghost town. And so Roy's Cafe is still operational. You can still fill up gas, but it's no longer serving food and is more of like a souvenir and gift shop place. So uh, it's really cool to be staying the night in a living ghost town and just kind of enjoy this Americana history. Uh, the Roy's Cafe sign still uh, turns on at night and it's just a very beautiful and cool spot to be. So we feel really lucky to be here.